I'm Henry Young and I'm a hundred now. I can't believe it, but I am. And uh, I live in Adelaide, South Australia. That's at the bottom of Australia. And it's a lovely place uh, on the coast. Uh, I'm still here, which absolutely amazes me. But, but here I am. Well, I suppose like most people, I started at school and I played um, all the time that I was at school. And of course, the war started while I was still at school. I didn't play much, much tennis during the war. All the airfields, I was in the Navy, I was Royal Navy. I, I wasn't, I was actually in New Zealand. My, I was born in Australia, but I went, my father was a banker and was transferred to New Zealand. So it was in the New Zealand Navy that I fought and they had a special scheme that sent you straight to the Royal Navy. Really, I suppose, until I retired. You know, I, I used to play um, a few games every year, but that was all. I was on the land and uh, being a farmer, I hate to say it, but I was 70 when I retired and given my time again, I would have retired at 65 because I love it so much. That's, that's, uh, that's 30 years ago. That's incredible, isn't it? 30 years. Amazing. <laughs> Well, it's the camaraderie, but I'm also a competitive person and I like the competitive aspect in it. And uh, I don't think you should be an average person. And if you're not going to be an average person, you want to know where you are. And tennis is a means of, of being assessed by outside people just where you are. And, and that's what I, I like about it. It's, um, uh, it's very fulfilling to, to know that you where you are in the hierarchy and and here I am at a hundred and I suppose I'm, I'm getting near the top of the tree just because all my, I hate to say it, but all my peers mostly have died off around me. Well, obviously tennis has no age limit. What bugs me is that so many of my peers have given up when they had some kind of uh, tennis ailment, like a tennis elbow or something, and they really shouldn't. It's um, uh, I'm a role model for longevity, but I'm also a monument to the medical profession. If you start it from the bottom up, I've got varicose veins that have been stripped. I've got two new knees. I've got a new hip. I've got a pacemaker for my heart attack. Uh, what are we up to? Up to, up to my eyes. I've got two lenses in my eyes. I've got two ear, ear, hearing aids. I've got a cochlear implant <laughs> last week and I'm just learning to work that, but um, really the, the medical profession is so good that when things wear out, they can, you can get them renewed. And, and here I am, I'm fit and strong and, and um, you know, with all those things behind me. Well, I came to here first when uh, 80, the first time I'd uh, uh, played overseas, of course, and it was a wonderful time. So. And Talia sets the, the, the pace for the rest of the world. It, the, the way that you mind it here is, is almost mind-boggling. It's, uh, it's wonderful. Individuals, because I'm, you know, because of my age, I, I, I can't aspire to be in the team any longer here, but uh, I couldn't wait to get here. It's wonderful. And Talia in Turkey does every tennis player proud. My name's Hayley Iverson. I'm the senior manager for the ITF Masters Tour. We are in Turkey for the World Championships for the age group 65 to 90. Um, we, first week one, we had the teams where we had 26 <laughs> nations represented in the age groups from 65 to 85. We also had 100-year-old Henry Young, and we also celebrated Leonard's birthday. Um, he was 100 when we, were, when we were here. The organisation has been absolutely fantastic. The relationship with the players, with the ITF, with the, the organisers from Turkish Tennis Federation, as well as Ali Bay Club, has been absolutely fantastic. And the feedback from everyone has been so, so good. We're so pleased that we were able to bring these players back to somewhere that they haven't been since 2014. I would just like to thank everybody that's been involved in this tournament. The work that's done it, behind the scenes and obviously in front where players um, see how well it's been organised. 
the, the thanks from the ITF go to the Turkish Tennis Federation and to Ali Bay Club for making sure that we've had, I think, one of the best tournaments we've had for a long, long time. And that's certainly the opinion of the, the players. Thank you very much. And we look forward to com coming back here very soon. Adım Kerem Kutbay, Ali Bey Hotels and Resorts bünyesinde Ali Bey Club ve Park Tesisinin genel müdürüyüm ben. World Masters sunuvasını gerçekleştiriyoruz. Bunu 13. kez yapıyoruz tesisimizde. Çok güzel bir havada, çok güzel bir iklimde, çok dostane bir ortamda bu turnuvayı bitirmiş olmanın gururunu yaşıyoruz şu an için. <gülüyor> Benedetti and I play for France. I started when I was nine, yes, and and I've been playing all my life. Um, I played on the international circuit and I was lucky enough to play with uh, Francoise Dieu and we won the French uh, Grand Slam tournament at Roland Garros three times and I was in the final six times and I won with another girl from um, Uruguay, Fiorella Bonicelli. So in all, I won four Grand Slam titles in doubles at Rolling Garros. I was in the final of the US Open doubles also and semi-finals of the Australian and um, uh, Wimbledon doubles. So I've done really better in doubles and singles, but I got to the quarters of the singles in Australia and in the French. Now, I've been here a few times and I've, I've always done very well and I really enjoy this site because there are 50 clay courts and we can get everybody together to enjoy this um, social meeting. And I'd like to thank the ITF and especially Haley because she's done a great job and she's always on the ball, <laughs> more than us. And um, I'd like to thank the Turkish Association for giving us this opportunity to be here and to enjoy our stay. Orta 65 yaş üstü insanlar 100 yaşında oyuncular gördük ve 100 yaşındaki oyuncular öyle böyle oynamıyorlar yani hani seni beni yenerler ve bu rekabette hoşgörüyü, saygıyı, birbiriyle olan sosyal ilişkiyi çok iyi gördük. Biz de kendi içimizde hala görüyoruz. İşte ben 51 yaşındayım. Çocuklar gibi bir şeyle uğraşıyoruz, bir rekabet ediyoruz. 55 yaşın üstü insanları, veteranlara sosyal bir alan yaratmak. Teniste 2-3 jenerasyonun bir arada oynayabileceği, bugün burada da gördük, 80'in üstündeki oyuncuların çok rahatlıkla vakit geçirebileceği, ter atabileceği çok güzel bir hobi. İnşallah bunu Türkiye'de daha da yayacağız. Çok da güzel noktalara gidiyor. Müzik